there is uh, three new programs that we are introducing at IIT Madras this year. The first one we'll talk about is this program on computational engineering and mechanics. Uh, this program is about creating a 21st century engineer who can harness the full power of computation. So computation today happens through computational fluid dynamics, finite element methods. There are electrical engineering tools that so that do computational modeling of a particular circuit. For example, a mobile phone PCB, before even the first piece is built, a, compute, a computer model is made of the whole uh, system or a subsystem. And it is exercised in silico, as they call, in silicon, before you go build the first prototype. The Boeing 777, which is a full flying aircraft today, the first ever prototype that was built was actually sold to a customer. The entire plane was designed in a computer, tested in the computer and put out for people to use. So these computational tools are very important for life in general, engineering life in general. This program emphasizes that. You can see there's a whole progression of curriculum that it blends electrical engineering, it blends mechanical engineering, material science, computational engineering, data science, AI, and then this idea of a digital twin. A digital twin means, let's say, uh, you take any complicated engineering system out there, let's say a power plant in, in Ramagundam or Singareni, or Singare or Ramagundam power plant. Uh, if I want to know the health of the power plant or of a, the whole system or any subsystem, I need a computer model that is at any instant of time an exact replica of the real power plant that is generating power. So this in silico model of the exact power plant that is out there is called a digital twin. In 10 years, you will have a digital twin of yourself in a computer model in some doctor's computer, okay? It's getting to that point where your personalized model, I mean, how is your heart beating? What is the food you are eating? As a result, what is the stress strain on your body? There's a model in which the doctor is able to sort of do a lot of what-if tests. One of my colleagues works on surgery modeling, modeling surgery. So you really play out different scenarios for the surgeon before the surgeon picks up the first knife. And in the computer model, you eliminate the things that are not going to work out and really find the optimal surgical process to actually exercise on the patient. This is the power of digital twins.